This is slide um, 10 of chapter 3. We're picking up with the organelle ribosomes. These are small dark stained spots or granules of proteins in a type of RNA called messenger RNA, also known as mRNA. And you can see on your diagram when we zoom in on it, ribosomes are either found on the ER, which is an example here. You can see the ribosomes on the ER. Uh, or they're um, also free inside of the cell that you can find them there. They're responsible for protein synthesis and the word synthesis means to make so you give you an idea you can say I'm going to synthesize dinner tonight I'm going to make dinner tonight. A ribosome is not just one piece there's actually two pieces called subunits and scientists have named these 60s and 40s for the small piece and you can see the note there on the slide that I've annotated for you. Um, when the cell needs to make a protein, messenger RNA is created in the nucleus and the messenger RNA is then sent into the cell and the ribosomes and when it's time to make a protein, these two subunits come together and combine with messenger RNA. The subunits lock into the messenger RNA and start the process of making proteins. Looking at our next slide, which is slide 11, we're going to look at the ER now, also known as the endoplasmic reticulum. Reticulum means to repeat over and over again, and that's what you're seeing here on this uh, membrane, this whole area right here where it goes back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Um, these are ribosomes on this ER. Um, basically, it's a network within the cytoplasm. It is connected to um, the uh, cell nucleus. It's continuous with the nuclear membrane. There's two types, smooth ER, which does not have ribosomes. Right here, it's very smooth. It does not play a part in making proteins. Uh, it does help with lipid metabolism, so the making of fats, steroid hormones, the detox of drugs, the breakdown of stored glycogen. And there's also rough ER, which is studded with ribosomes. And you can see those ribosomes here in the dark dots all over the ER and those um, are involved in producing proteins in cells. And slide 12, we're looking at the Golgi complex or apparatus. It's thought of oftentimes as the traffic director for all cellular activities. Some people also refer to it as a post office. Its main function is to modify, concentrate, and package up macromolecules. And macromolecules are large molecules like proteins and lipids. Um, that are processed in the ER. You can see that the Golgi apparatus is uh, it looks very similar to a stack of folded pancakes. It's a membrane network folded back on itself and there are little bitty vesicles or sacs that are created on uh, the Golgi complex to transport things. Um, basically the Golgi body or complex gathers simple molecules and it combines them to make molecules that are more complex is a good way to think about it. And it um, takes these big molecules and packages them up in these sacs, these vesicles, and it either stores them for later use or sends them out into the cell. Um, this particular organelle also is involved in building lysosomes. It uh, has a role with lipids and the formation of lysosomes, and we're going to be talking about lysosomes here shortly.